today, guys, we are in our grandmother house again. I come to look for her. Join me. <laughs> so she gave me a beautiful lango. Today, my grandmother is going to share a little bit of how she grew up her kids. Uh, because we want to hear a little bit about growing up because they grow different from us and I love to hear old kind of story. Come on mama, let me know how you grew up your kids then. Mm -hmm. how school. Every last one. Them no go to school till they reach to XYZ time but all have gone to school, right? Me a lot of you have to cook food and care about. Oh, oh, Alright, when I go to school, mm -hmm. and I'm going to find something and cook and come with them down the road. Really. Mm -hmm. So sometimes, me not think you really find what to give them. Sometimes. I know, one day especially. I tried, but there was nothing. And then, God, I used to, sometimes when I can make it. Myself, mm -hmm. Lizette, and Sister Lizette, and um, me, Lizette, and Miss... I see. Mm -mm. Miss Esty. Oh. And Miss B used to go down the road for a woman who can get the food, go down the road, go to the children then at 12 o'clock. So when you couldn't find it that day, what happened? Them go down there or what? Or the kids them have to come home or what they happened? Come home. So them know that no food no come now? No, they don't meet me. They don't meet me, so they have to come home. Oh. They don't meet me and then they have to come home. I mean, maybe one or two times or so, you know, and a whole lot of time that happened. So all of your children, them is twelve, right? All of them go to, to, through school, right? Every single last one. That is None men didn't want to go to school. Some of them carry, but you know, boy picking them bad and then this, you know. Yeah. Sometimes young go to school. You know, picking other side from school. Yeah. You know yeah. me hide from school. You hide from school. Hey, no, enough time though. <laughs> no, not that oh. time. We couldn't do that. Oh, but then my mother would give me, give me some, give me some leave. Okay. Like if I had children that She sent you go to school and you hide from school. You hear that? Yeah. <laughs> what teacher near me saw on this line? God, if you're sleeping, kill you with like, I want my teacher. <laughs> no, I can't believe it. Yeah. You hide from school? Yeah, maybe one or two hours of time. Hmm. You know. I just don't want to continue to figure it out. Okay. Mm, you know, good at fighting. Mm. Mother know all of that. Jesus Christ. And then she'll have the general public, no matter. Okay. Tell them, Mike, you remember? Mm-hmm. When we do anything all over my yard, and my mother don't beat me, help me catch me. Because me <laughs> not going to beat me, I'm not going Not at all. I was afraid of it. Oh, okay. Mm, I was still afraid of it, man. <laughs> but apart from that, and life turns out okay. Hmm? Life turns out okay in spite of all of that rough time. Rough time, time. All in a rough time yes. When you start to work down on Carl Fall, things kind of change. Okay. A little bit. I used to work with a soon come down. I, was, well, I, soon come. Mm -hmm. I had a cousin by the name of Adeline Show that put down here. Okay. And she did love me. And I really could deal in. Every time I want a dear work person, mm -hmm. she would have called me. And then me getting, uh, we get in love with one another. We didn't, she will hear about me, you understand yeah. me? But when we draw near to one another, she just loved me and every little thing. Mm -hmm. You know, she would have called me and, you know. And then you get the work down there? Mm-hmm. Oh, so that you time when, I, when, when, when you go down there to work with her, you were a Christian that time? Mm -hmm. So you weren't a Christian? So how you used to be here? No, me, no, I started to, um, no, <laughs> getting, having the children, you kind of start to change okay. your lifestyle. Not complete, you know. So who was modeling before she gets saved? Who? Who was my oh, grandmother I mean, before you were a Christian? So first I'll start with my beautiful mom over here to tell me what you know about mama when she, oh, she was home. And then mama can come in with, with the rest. Go ahead. How oh, she used to? Just start how she before she was a Christian. We would like to know. Yes, we want to know. We would mm -hmm. like to know. She was really rough. Okay, Especially like for me. She was really, really rough. Mm -hmm. She had three girls before. 
Like, oh, myself included. I know, no matter time. what. Oh, okay. No matter how simple the thing is, she always murders, especially me. I get for the whole district, right? Merle always be the first one to go and get beat. And beat. And me and Christine always go inside and underneath the bed. Okay. And she used to beat us, try to beat us. I give her the hardest. Because she I'm was not afraid of it. Uh, yes, she was afraid. Christine was so afraid of it. But I was the one not taking no beating that easy. Okay. I'm not doing it. I'm fighting. Seriously. I'm not taking no beating that mm. easily. So she used to beat me a lot. Mm -hmm. Yes. So, um, like, apart from that, before she was a Christian, she like used to curse and then she changed just out. Carry on, just carry on, just a normal person. And then she becomes saved. Mama, how you get you become saved? Anybody introduce you to Christ or they're preaching at the roadside? No, no roadside, I do In a church. So in a church you get saved? Right there. I give my life to the Lord. Okay. Give my life to the Lord. That's okay. It. So you change same time, you change off everything same time? You can't change off everything. So it was hard at first? Like when I get saved it, it was hard at first or you have people to encourage you and all of that? Mm -hmm. Encourage yourself. Yeah, because you encourage yourself in your life. You, you is your decision. Mm -hmm. My decision is to walk with the Lord, to, you know, right. to serve the Lord. Mm -hmm. Stop yep. doing negative things and right. speaking negative words and right. but all of that. Doing, you know, when she a try to say, um, nowadays when time like you get baptized. Sometimes you don't have nobody like fish put you up on the right path. Them just you decide say they might go win soul and leave and you leave your by life yourself. Life. So you don't know where to go from 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 there. No, because we always have preachers coming. Okay. You understand? Mm -hmm. So we just go to church. That's the most basic. You oh, go yes. to church yes. and then you get encouragement. Right. That strengthens you. Sister Parker. Um, Sister Clarice, I always visit them. Mm -hmm. Those old people, oh, those yeah. old patriarchs. Mm -hmm. Miss Sana would come and encourage you. I mean, the other people, you understand? Mm -hmm. Miss Varys mm -hmm. and oh my God. Sister Parker and, and, and um, Sister Clarice, mm -hmm. especially those two ladies. You understand? Yeah. They would come and encourage you. And then we, I would walk, my intention was to walk and visit them and then we talk about Christ and all of that. I go to my sister Clarissa and let me talk. I make go up my sister Maurice and, mm -hmm. and if 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 I'm weighted down with any burden or stuff like that, you go and you share it with them. Yes. And they would back you up with the word of God. Oh my so, God. So it was so good. We missed them because but that's how life is. Yeah. You can hardly find people like those in no, this time. No, especially these days. Yes. You can't find people like those. Those were amazing. Especially Sister Parker. Mm -hmm. I tell you. Uh, and being with Christ, you have no regrets. In no regrets. In spite of how you have so many Sometimes challenges. Sometimes you feel cast out yes. when things come up, you know. Mm -hmm. Like, when life gets rough, you never maybe expect say, something. Some things will happen to you when you become a Christian, you know, yeah. That you wouldn't believe. Say, oh my yes, God. I am God. Why did Why this happen, happen to me? Me hungry, what me hungry? Right. What me naked and all that stuff like that. You understand? Yeah. But you, you know, really they get this and that because in times like those, a chop and sand, pop and sand, pound and shilling and them that we used to use. You understand? Mm -hmm. And sometimes you have nothing to do. You have to go pick a line sometimes, pimento. You don't understand mm -hmm. if you work and get a um, couple of dollars that you can really support yourself, right? Because mm -hmm. there was no big backup, you understand? Okay. But the kids, they was getting big at the time when they get saved, right? So mm -hmm. they were yeah, so man. hard and... Mm -hmm. Still very hard. Because oh. they still have to be going to school, yeah. It's still very hard, but nevertheless, you decide your mind, say, I'm going to trust God and live, mm -hmm. right? I mean, I'm not regret serving God. He's so good. Right, right. I know what gives me recognize that God is so sweet. So good. He is so good. <laughs> oh, my God. God. Good, 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 good. Oh, my, my God. God. Almighty, 
You're saying you're saying for victory. Amen. Amen. When I'm cast down, my God, and I turn to my Bible and I read a verse of scripture, my God Almighty, it lifts my spirit. Yes. Right? And even if you want to cuss me and do me anything, I do your business. Yes. Me you business, sweet in your Jesus. Me. I just want to big up my God. Amen. Because I want to feel good in yes. my God. And yes. I want to live good. Listen. In spite of what happened, mm -hmm. you see the attack of this virus that is going on here, yeah. it's going to be rougher, mm -hmm. it's going to be harder, yes. and things are going to be... It's going to get worse. It's going to be worse, yes. worse, worse every 